friends, Misha Crossing here, back with more uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild, and I am just so ready to get into this episode. I've had my morning coffee, had a nice long shower, both of those happened together. Um, if you've never had shower coffee, it is indeed the best coffee. Uh, and I am all fueled up for our quest to... Get the Master Sword, which the Master Sword is somewhere uh, deep in the Great Hyrule Forest. And uh, we are going to go find it. My boyfriend Joey has gotten the- am I on the road? What's happening? Yeah. <clears throat> has gotten the Master Sword in his game and I like halfway watched while he was getting it. I'm not quite sure of the method. I know you just get swallowed up into the mist if you go off course. Uh, but I'm- oh god. Not quite sure what the course is. <laughs> the mist. The mist swallows you up. I don't want to get swallowed by the mist. Not today. Not today, Satan. I mean, this is it. This is the Great Hyrule Forest. We are- we're right here, so let's go into it. Oh, what's this? An acorn? Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do indeed. Oh god, look at all those crows. That is an ominous sign if I've ever seen one. Okay, so there's some fire. There's some more fire. <clears throat> some stone structures. Uh, oh god. I just don't want to mess up. Well, okay. I guess I'll demonstrate what happens if you just wander off. Um, I'm, so I think you have to follow the flames. <laughs> Is what happens. Um, the witch of the of the waste gets ya. <laughs> um... Not even what the Witch of the Way sounds like. But, <clears throat> so I think you have to follow the fire. And since the fire's here, I might as well light it. I don't think you can just walk anywhere. If you're holding fire, I think you have to follow these. They're not torches. They're not, I don't know what they are. Posts of fire. Hello. Oh, am I gonna encounter any enemies? There's a cute little Bambi deer. This forest is is so cool. I love the music. The music is so <laughs> ominous. I just feel like I'm gonna get swallowed up at any time. All right, I guess this one is the next closest one. <laughs> Don't kill me. So I think if I go off course, I get put back right at the beginning again. <laughs> and you can't can't take too long to get to the next spot. Oh dear. Oh dear me. This is a dead end, isn't it? It sure is. See fire over there. Okay. So let's retrace our steps here, kids. Um... There wasn't really any other options, any other places to go, was there? I don't think so. Oh, there's one right there. <gasps> Please, no! I got swallowed up. I thought that was close enough. Shit. Forest. Why you gotta do me like that? Why you gotta play me? Is there another entrance that I should be going to? No, I mean, this is the one... The one entrance on this side. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> or do I just have to book it? Do I just have to book it to that next, um... Torch. That was... A little too far away. Maybe, I don't know if it's... I don't know if it absorbs you over a certain amount of time of being in the forest or if it's 
a certain amount of space you wander from the flame. Does that make sense? Where was it? I thought it was over here. Okay, guess not. So if it's a timed sort of thing, um, okay. Then maybe I can, yeah, just book it. Okay, this is the dead end. I thought, I thought, I thought we, uh, I just looked around all of these. Oh, shoot. <sighs> okay, let's do this again. I'll do it a bit better this time. Maybe. Hopefully. Oh, you guys. Okay, so I just noticed... All the particles and the flames are going in one direction. Am I supposed to follow that? Am I supposed to go to that flame over there next? So that's the one I just came from. Oh boy, let's uh... Let's try it. Wow! That worked! Okay. So we follow the patterns of the particles of, I guess, pretty much the direction of the wind. Okay, yes, yeah, so, but, but is the rule still that I have to have, these trees are so cool. Is there treasure in here? Yes, there is. Gimme. Forest dweller spear, cool. It's only 11 though, but it's made of wood and it looks awesome and it was made by the Kuroks and they're my favorite little uh, species. <laughs> We're gonna drop our moblin. Oh god, that thing is huge. I forget how big those are. I know it's a bit of a step down, but I just really want to have the forest dweller stuff. God, these faces on all these trees. Spooky. All right. So let's keep following the particles, I suppose. Can I save? Oh god. Going this way. Still going this way? Now we're going this way. Oh my gosh, I am so stinking nervous. Just have to- ooh! More treasure? Oh, but I don't want to put out my- my torch. Where are we in the forest anyways? We have barely made any progress, I feel like. We just came in from right there, and now we're just- Oh, I mean, I guess that's a fair distance. I don't know. Um, yeah, I don't want to have to relight my torch, so unfortunately I am going to let that treasure chest go. Oh god. I feel like it's going to lead me in circles. It's, is it leading me in circles? Oh, hello, Mama Papa Elk. Excuse you. <laughs> How can they live? <gasps> Shrine nearby. Okay. Now which way? Now this way. This is so cool. Okay, so we're still going this way. Oh, I thought I saw something magical floating around. I guess not. Ooh, here's an opening! Oh, cool, we're coming to kind of the first open area of the forest. 
which looks like it is going to be a shrine. Yep, we are <laughs> beeping real hard. Now we're not beeping anymore. Okay, there we go. It's because I- Oh, <gasps> look at the cherry blossoms! Hello? <gasps> it's all clearing up now! Oh, and here's the cherry tree! Oh my god, we've made it! Guys, we've made it to Grove Forest! Look at all our buddies! Our buddies! <laughs> this is... The most, in my opinion, the most beautiful place in the game. I've definitely seen Karok Forest before. I couldn't watch Joey play and not not walk around Karok Forest. Oh, and there's Hestu. And guys, here it is. Oh. It's dangerous to go alone. We should take this. Hmm. You are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. Of course it does. Ooh. The HD rumble just kicked in. Oh. Who is that? Did I doze off again? Huh. It's Grandma Willow. decided to return. Better late than never. After 100 years, I've nearly given up hope on seeing you again. Even my patience has limits, you know. Mm -hmm. I love them. That look on your face tells me that you have no recollection of me, however. I have watched over Hyrule since time. That is the weapon created by the ancient goddess. Ooh. The sword that seals the darkness that only the chosen knight can wield against the Calamity Ganon. Believe it or not, it was actually you who wielded that sword 100 years ago. Really? But I must warn you to take extreme caution. The sword stands as a test to anyone who would dare attempt to possess it. As you are now, I cannot say whether you are worthy or not. If you sought to free the sword in any sort of weakened state, you would surely lose your life where you stand. <laughs> I love that. They acted out. Best of luck, young one. <laughs> oh, well, we have been given some information. And while he was telling me that information, you must use your true strength. Let us see whether or not you are currently possess you currently possess said power. The hero sword, new objective. Um, so yeah, I forgot you have to have 13 hearts to get the Master Sword, and I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So I need 4 more. Um. Okay, so my stamina I have increased twice, so I could technically go get... Um, my stamina exchanged for hearts in Hatino Village at that one special statue where you can exchange hearts for stamina, but I'd still need to get two more hearts, like, from a shrine. So I need to do... I think I have one spirit orb right now, so I'll need to do seven more shrines before I can get the Master Sword. But we found it! And once we get the 
shrine nearby. We will have a fast travel spot in the forest, and uh, we can come back and get the Master Sword afterwards. Uh, so we've got Kurok Forest on our map. No fast travel spot yet. So let's... Hmm. I love all the little Kuroks around me. Go into... The general store that is inside the Deku tree. I can't remember. Is this the entrance? No. Where's the entrance? Must be right over here. Yep. Well, let's go talk to. Okay, there's the entrance right there. This fellow here with the mushrooms. I love he's got the little fungi growing on his head. You're Mr. Hero! Mr. Hero is here! The mushroom on my head suddenly sprouted today, so I knew something was up. It was a prediction that you'd come, I think. That's cute. Um, oh, they prepared some trials just for me. If you pass the very tough trials we've prepared, pulling out the Master Sword will be a piece of cake. Probably. Among the trials is an extra tough one designed by me, the Elder of Kurok Forest. So, will you test... Your medal in the Kurok Trials? Um, let's do that in a minute. <laughs> if you do it, I'll tell you all about the time Hestu fell flat on his face while dancing, even though I promised I wouldn't. <laughs> you don't seem interested. I give up. I, I don't know, do those give you... <clears throat> do the trials give you hearts? Hmm. This is so pretty. This is definitely... Yeah, inside here is like my favorite spot in the game. If I could live here, I 100% would. And we've got a few things in here. They've prepared some stuff to sell me. Welcome to the general shop. I sell a lot of stuff here. Things that I gather in the forest. Things that I don't gather in the forest. <laughs> Please choose anything you want or have you come to sell. I am definitely going to buy your hearty radish. Wow, I don't have much money, but... I'm gonna do what I can. They have shock arrows. Oh man. Maybe I should sell them some stuff. Okay, I am gonna sell them some gems and things. Okay, I sold some gems and now we have 1500 rupees, so I can definitely by all of these arrows. I really need to get some fire arrows, but I have a feeling I won't need those in the Kurok Forest, so... Not in a huge rush. Let's see what else there is in here. We got some mushrooms! Iron shrooms, rush rooms, stamella mushrooms. Oh, a hearty truffle, definitely. I thought you might be hungry, so I went out and gathered a bunch of forest mushrooms for you. Just let me know if you want to sell any of your stuff, okay? Thank you. Oh wait, these are the iron shrooms and these are the razor shrooms. They look really similar to me for some reason. I get them mixed up. I'll take all of these. We'll cook some stuff before we head back out on. Here's the inn. Look at this bed! Why can't I live here? Oh, I want to live here so bad. What is going on in these pots? Ooh, I do not do not want to break my torch. I can break the sledgehammer though. <laughs> what? Nothing. There's nothing in there. God, I want to live here. It, it's Mr. Hero. Mr. Hero came to visit us in the forest. What took you so long? Peaks. Thought of a trial that will make Mr. Hero stronger. You will not have to fight, and it's not scary. But you'll need to be extra careful. So I want to see a bloopy. It's a blue, glowy, hoppy thing that glows in the dark. Just about peak size. I just really want to see a bloopy, even if it's just a picture of one. Oh, it's a, uh... That owl, rabbit, spirit forest? Spirit forest. Forest spirit um, that you can shoot and get rupees from, I think. So... 
Yeah, I heard they're little blue glowing critters hopping around Hyrule. They're called bloopies. So next time I see him, I will take a picture of him. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna cook just- oh, no, let's not sit. Just gonna cook a couple of things real quick. Oh, I forgot to mention the silent princess, the flower I was picking up. I was too busy yakking. This flower, this lovely flower was said to have, was said to have been a favorite of the princess of Hyrule. Once feared to have gone extinct, it's recently been spotted growing in the wild. Next to the master sword, of course. Okay, let's see. I think that's really all... I'll go ahead and cook these mushrooms, and then we're done. Cool. Back out into the forest, and... Yeah, I definitely want to go... Find the shrine. Well, let's go talk to Hestu, and then we'll go find the shrine. Oh, what do these signs say? Hold on. The test of wood, forest exit shortcut. Hmm. Cool. Nice to know. <laughs> so test of wood is this way, whatever that is. Um, I guess one of the trials- oh hey! I see the shrine back there. It's all glowy and orange. Hi, Hestu. I know who you are. I'm impressed you found your way through the lost woods and made it here. So, have you brought me any Kurok seeds? I sure hope so. If you return my lost Kurok seeds, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, well, I guess I don't- I haven't really found that many Kuroks. I only have two. I think that might expand my shields, but... My shield slots, but nothing else. Oh, here we go. The shrine in the Kurok Forest. I- I probably watched Joey do this one. Slash did it with him, but we'll see whenever we... Go inside. Come on. Let's go. Fateful stars. Oh, yeah. I do remember this one. Um, kind of. <laughs> Look at the stars for guidance. The constellations are the key, says the sign. So that is blocked down there. We've got constellations up here. And constellations down here. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I remember. Okay. Uh, yeah, so these are lined up. One, two, three, four, and five. And then there's a constellation at the beginning of each column. Um, so I just have to count how many times that constellation shows up in this chart up here and then put the ball in the corresponding number here. Okay, cool. So the first one, there's one, two, three, four, five. I think. Seems right. Oh, here are the balls. Thank you. Yeah, there's definitely no more than five of them. Oh! And that told me it was right. Cool. And then this one's a little bit more complicated. But I see a one, and a two, and a three. Three. I do bleed. Yay! Got it right. Um, this next one's even more complicated. See, stop. I think just the once. Yeah. Just the one time. And then the last one appears twice. Yeah, twice. Sweet. Whoops. <laughs> Pardon me. Go ahead. Yay! I love the puzzle solving noise. Oh wow, that completely did it? No, there's gotta be treasure. There was something else to it. Yeah, here it is. Okay. 
So now I have to move the balls to correspond with how many there are on this one. So there are one, two, three... I need to write this down. Hold on. Okay, so the next set should be four, two, two, one. <gasps> Yay! We got it. I'm glad I didn't have to, like, go back and recount. Alright, what you got for me? Knight's Claymore, 38. I will take it. What do I have? Oh, yeah. Definitely drop that iron sledgehammer. That is dunzo. Yesterday's news. Welcome to the party, Claymore. God, that is just massive. Not as big as the boulder breaker, but still pretty big. Okay, we are ready to get out of this shrine. I am so glad that I remembered <laughs> Joey doing that. That one probably would have taken me a minute, because I remember when we saw that one, our first thought was that we needed to, like, draw the constellations with the balls, which just, I mean, obviously wasn't the thing. We tried to do it with the first one that was just three points, which, you know, we could draw that one, but the rest of them were so crazy complicated, there was no way. <laughs> and then eventually we figured out. That it was just the number of times the constellations appeared <laughs> on that that wall back there. Oh, so now what should we do? I suppose I should try to do one of the trials. I can try to do that trial of of wood, which I think is yeah to the left right there. Making my way downtown, walking fast, faces fast, and hold back. Da -na 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 -na. Keep hiding from me when I walk past them. <laughs> Which is actually pretty cute. But I wish I could just oh god. See them all the time. Am I ready? I was told you'd be coming, but do you really think you're ready for the test of wood? Some say it's the hardest of the Kurok trials. But it's not complicated. All you need to do is equip this Kurok weapon set and reach the shrine at the back of the area. Are you ready to try it? Okay, I'm ready. You have to keep the sword, bow, and shield equipped the whole time. If they break or you unequip them, you're out. Oh, your inventory is full. You need to make space for a sword, shield, and bow, and we can get started. Okay. I know they said this is the hardest one, but... It, oh, why am I still wearing that? Okay. Uh, let's drop that one. Wait, I didn't need to drop that one. I just needed to drop a sword. <laughs> well, I might as well drop this spear. Goodbye. It'll be here when I get back. I mean, I don't see why I shouldn't try it. I don't know exactly uh, where else the other Kurok trials are. Because there weren't, weren't any more signs pointing to where different tests were. Whatever, we'll try this. Might as well just dive on in. And we get a shrine as a reward for completing it. So, you know, why not? All we have to do is reach the shrine. Easy peasy lemon mix squeezy. Off we go. <laughs> oh, God. Um, but I assume I can also get swallowed up by the mist. So do I still need to... Follow the particles. I'm basically just going to ignore everything that I can. Oh god. Oh god. Can't ignore it. Ah. <laughs> Nope. Okay, I'm gonna need to use a bomb. 
pardon me. Oh, Jeezy Pete's. Jeezy. Okay. Nope. Not what I need to do. There's a bog there. That's not what you want. Ha! Ah! Oh my god. Yes, please. Thank you. I would love to ride the wind. Oh. Ha! Ah! <laughs> this is getting intense. Please. <laughs> I'll just run through it. Whatever. Oh god. Okay. Please go over to that bomb. Ah. Ooh, but that thing is getting set on fire, so that's good. Ooh. Look at this, guys. <laughs> oh. I am really glad I didn't kill those fire keys because they are making some updrafts for me. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and heal myself. Oh, <sighs> Take a little breather because this is really intense. There's a lot of things coming at me at once. I just, w I know that these weapons won't last um, more than a couple of hits, but I've still got them all, right? Yeah, okay, I still have them all. <laughs> Only used the sword once. Oh, man. Do not know. <gasps> There's the shrine! Oh, God. Um... Can I use? I can? Ha, 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 ha. I honestly didn't know I could use this ability in the bog. Oh my jeezy peeps, I made it. <laughs> oh. That was stressful. That was very stressful. Well done, hero man. Happiness awaits you at the shrine. Oh yeah, if you ever want to do the trial again, just... Why would anybody want to do that trial again? Why would anyone? Oh god, they're still shooting shit at me. Go away! Get out of here. I wish I could take those arrows from him. Oh. <sighs> This better be a blessing shrine, because God knows I earned a blessing today. Oh, praise be. Praise be blessing shrines, honestly. Better get something good for it, too. Giant ancient core. I still can't remember exactly what those are used for. Um, I don't know if they're used for making armor or upgrading armor or what. Thank you. So now I have three spirit orbs. Just need uh, four more. No, five more. <laughs> to get to where I need to be with my hearts to get the master sword. So we are all the way back here. Wow, we made it quite, quite the ways. Avoided death quite well. I want to be able to explore all of this back here. How can I do that? Well, guys, I know this is a little bit of a shorter episode than normal, but I'm going to end the episode here. Next episode, I am 100% going to get the Master Sword. I completely forgot about the 13 hearts requirement, so apologies in advance. I know I, I said I was going to get the Master Sword in this episode, but hey, at least we saw it. We found it. We did the damn thing. Uh, but next episode, we're really gonna do the damn thing and <laughs> get 13 hearts. Just need to basically uh, blast through a few shrines. So I'll probably play off screen, off camera a bit uh, to find a few shrines. I might do a couple on my own. 
Uh, or I might just find them and then record them next time. I'll let you know. Hope you all are still enjoying this playthrough of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Let me know where you are in the game. I'm sure a ton of you have beat it already, but let me know. What is your favorite area in the game? Kuroke Forest is definitely mine by far. Um, of course, there are areas that I haven't seen. Uh, even in Joey's playthrough of it, I haven't seen every area, but this one is my favorite so far. All right, you all have a wonderful day. Be kind to one another. Don't forget to be awesome. Bye.